Well, I guess um, in in my mind, it's a question of learning how we can move forward uh, in a more sustainable manner than, than we are currently uh, doing today. Um, we have to accept the fact that there are limitations uh, on growth and that there are uh, limited resources that are uh, being depleted rapidly in, in many cases and that learning how to live within our planetary means um, is probably going to be the, the key challenge of this coming century. So much of our economic, uh, political, and social organizations and, and activities are based on the assumption of, of continued and endless growth. And um, I think we're already bumping up against many of those limits even, even today. And that um, we need to figure out ways of sustaining ourselves both economically and physically um, from the natural resources that we have available uh, to us. And in, in many cases, those resources that are available uh, all around us uh, in, our, in our own communities. Uh, and so I think that the uh, so-called relocalization movement, which is gaining ground uh, in communities all over the world, uh, is what we need to be focusing most of our attention on. And if we can't get the national governments to pay attention, then we need to do it on us here in this country, at least on a, perhaps a statewide or even local community basis. Uh, and that's certainly been a fairly strong focus of um, my recent work.